guys make awesome girl tattoos in our movies. I like. I'm pretty sure it's part number. I think it's six. I think so. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure this one is part six. So for today's video, we'll be talking about movies I like. I got a couple of DVDs from downstairs that I'm gonna want to show off. I have them right in front of me. They're all stacked up together, so I'm gonna want to show them off. So yeah. And before I get to that, or before I talk about that, well, first things first. I don't know if I've ever shown off this shirt before. If I have, then correct me if I'm wrong. Um. It's a dog. It's a stain on the shirt, but mostly it's a dog. I probably, I have a feeling I have, but just in case I haven't, it's a dog. I think it's a pug if I get the dog breed right. And it's white and it's got a purple little um, collar, which is very cute in my opinion. Um, so I haven't had this shirt for long. Um, I think last time, one of the other times I wore it, I couldn't even remember I had the shirt. I didn't, couldn't remember if it was old or new. It's just, yeah, I didn't even remember wearing this, so I couldn't tell if it was old or new, because I, I just know I don't think I've ever worn it before, really, if that makes any sense. So, sorry if I'm talking a lot, too. I do that a lot. So, But basically, what I'm trying to say is I think this shirt is cool. Um, I can't tell if it's old or new. I just know I haven't worn it in a long time. It might be more newer, because I just don't really remember wearing it that much. So, I, I don't know, really, but I just know it's very cute. Uh, yeah, dog is cute. Um, so, yes. And real quick, before I talk about the movies, I want to talk about what happened on Wednesday. The, um, was it, if I get this right, the Washington Capitol was stormed by, um, terrorists. Ter terrorists. Ter terrorists. Now, hopefully I'm saying that word right. Terrorists. Um, and it's just like, oh my gosh, why? You know, like, I just don't understand these people. Um, so I don't, I just don't understand. And this is definitely an act of terrorism. Definitely. I shouldn't be touching my face. The terrorists. Ter terrorism. I can never pronounce that word right, I guess. Terrorism. Terrorism. I just, I don't understand. I just don't, I'm speechless about this. This is just so wrong. And, oh, I'm mad just thinking about this. Yeah, it just gets me angry. And we, we just get, just get Trump out now. Let's just get him out now and get Joe Biden in the now. thought I heard something. But, yeah, let's get him, Joe in now and Trump out now, please. We need an update, like I mentioned a couple of videos ago. We need a new president. We need a new update. So, come on, Joe. So, Yes. So once Joe gets in, he, I think like he's gonna be so much better than Trump. Trump, <laughs> no, um, I'm not a Trump supporter. Obviously, you could tell when I say Joe Biden. Yeah, a huge. I like Joe Biden. Um, there's a video of him like talking to this little younger person who has Down syndrome, and it just right away got my heart. And I could just see he's kind, and he just seems like a good person, and he hopefully does good things. So I. I am already liking him. I didn't know much about him before. I knew he was with Obama in 2009. He was a vice president for Obama. So, and Obama, I liked better than Trump, obviously. So, <laughs> Obama is good, too. So, but yeah, I just want to say real quick that I just don't understand this act of terrorism. It's just not right, and it's just so wrong, and some of these people are just are just stupid. That's just my opinion. I'm not a Trump supporter, obviously, but... I just, sometimes I just don't understand. So I'm just checking the time real quick. 6.21. No, stop that. Um, but yeah, I just, I don't really understand. But I'm just going to move on to more, more, I just want to get to the video. So yeah, but I just, I just don't understand. I'm speechless. It's just so wrong and I don't, it's just, uh, yeah, I'm speechless. I'll just get on to the first movie. First movie I'm going to be talking about is Bohemian Rhapsody. I love this movie. It's an Oscar, was it an Oscar winning movie or something like that? Yeah. I think so. Let me read it. It says that. Um, Oscar winning or something like that. So it won the award. Yep. So this is such a good movie. If you've never seen it before, it's based on Queen, the band Queen. <clears throat> so yeah, if you've never seen it, it's basically, it says, Behemoth Rhapsody celebrates the band Queen, their music, and their extremely lead singer, Freddie Mercury, defied convention to become one of the history's most beloved entertainers. Yes, for sure. And it's such a good movie. If you've never seen it, go check it out if I don't know where you would find it. Maybe on DVD somewhere, like I have right now, or maybe on the internet somewhere. If you can eventually find this one, then I have a feeling you'll like it. I liked it. It was pretty good. Um, Freddie Mercury's awesome. So this is a really cool movie. If you haven't seen it, like I said, I'm not sponsored. I keep saying that, but it's true. Um, I'm not sponsored, but go check out this movie. It's really awesome. It's just so good. You can get it on Blu-ray and a bunch of other ways, hopefully. Yeah, it says right here, Blu-ray. DVD and digital. So you can get it those three ways in a way. Something like that. Yeah, and it says version Frank French Francais includes. So that means like French edition. So if you speak French, which I don't, I know some French, but if you speak that language and you you mostly talking that, then there's a version for you somewhere. I don't know where that would be. So 
Or it says version included. Okay, so there's yeah, there's two discs. There's two discs. Yeah, I think that means probably the French one. Probably. Yeah, I'm just looking on the inside. There's the DVDs and everything. Yep. Alright, moving on to the second movie. Um if this video ends early, I might either turn the radio on or do another um, I don't know if you would say a somersault, but something like that. And the other day, or the other time I did this, which was a couple of days ago on Wednesday, I almost was standing on my head. I actually was, so that's why I got scared. So I did, that was totally unpredictable. I didn't think I was going to go back that way much, but I was almost ready to prop right back up from doing it because I was actually standing on my head, almost. Yeah, so that definitely scared me. So, <laughs> so that's very funny to me, so... Already, it's like one of the first bloopers of 2021. That and when I dropped the iPad a bit. Well, that's because I twitch. I'm still twitching. Twitch, twitch, twitch. Um, so, excuse me if I twitch a bit. Second movie is a old movie. It's a Disney movie, I think. Is it Disney? Yes, it's Walt Disney Productions. Bolt. If you've ever seen this movie, you'll know this movie, obviously. <laughs> um, but if you've never seen it, go check it out. It'll be somewhere. My Cyrus is in this movie. She is, I believe, Penny. You see? Penny, and then there's John Travolta. He's actually Bolt. He voices the dog, and a bunch of phone came up. Oh, someone just posted a new TikTok video. Okay, I'm gonna have to see that later. Something like that. Yeah. So Bolt. What does that say at the bottom? Best Disney film since The Incredibles. At least this person. That's what this person's saying. Okay. So yeah, Bolt. It's really good. It's an underrated movie in my opinion. Underrated. Did I say we're underrated? That's what I'm trying to say. It's really good. It's like I said, my size John Travolta. It's really cool. Let me read the back. It says, um. Yeah, let it begin. Get ready for the most totally awesome adventure ever as bold the cool phone. Did you hear that noise? I went ding. Twitter permanently suspends Trump's account citing risk of further incitement of violence. That's what the yeah, I was like, here, I'll show you the notification. Hey, no, stop that. News top stories. You, oh wait, it's too bright. Can you or maybe you can, can you see that? You probably can, but it says new top stories. It's news kind of. I, don't really follow the news that much, but that's a good thing. We should get rid of Trump once and for all. <laughs> um, get rid of him. I don't like him. I'm, yeah, I'm. I, I could care less about Donald Trump. No, nope, don't like him at all. So, but anyways, while I was reading, the coolest actor here on earth, Bolt, and then me, Rhino, his faithful partner and right hand hamster, set off on a secret, super secret mission. Uh, yeah. So it's basically Bolt who thinks he's like. Because they're in a TV show together, if I remember right. He thinks he's actually a real, actual action hero in a TV show. Because that's what it's based on and stuff like that. Let me read it. One day I'm watching... Oh, no, sorry. He thinks he's in the actual TV show when he goes out and tries to say Penny. Or at least he thinks he's saying Penny or something like that. Oh, my mom was like... <laughs> kind of a big laugh. I don't know what made her laugh. Um, but anyways, but basically, I think something like that. So he thinks he's an actual action TV star. He thinks he is, cause they're, cause you could see they're filming it. But the dog really does think he's actually the action star, like in real life as well. So or at least in real life in a movie. Yeah, though, in this universe. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. So, yeah, it's really cool. It's definitely action packed for sure. And if you've never seen it, go check it out. It's cute to my size. Like I said, I love her in this movie. There's a song that's featured in the movie. That I have on my music app. I'm going to play it. Because I really love it. So if I could just. Go to music. I thought I, thought I lost you. My Cyrus and John Travolta. So let me find it real quick. If I go to. Um, if it lets me. Hold on. I'm just checking this. Um, um, real quick. I just want to. Hold on. First movie I want to show off, I just want to get to this one real quick. Greatest Showman, if you've never seen this movie before, go check it out. It's an amazing movie. I love it. All music is so good in this movie. I love Hugh Jackman. I love Zac Efron. Zendaya. Um, this is brave. I am proof. I am proof. I am who? I didn't think I said it right. Sorry. This is me. Look out, because here I come. And this is the greatest show. I could sing all the songs in the movie if I could. Like, why don't we rewrite the stars? Whoever I'm serenading is for you. <laughs> Made to be mine. Nothing can keep. Us apart. You were the one I was meant to find. Such a good movie. Um, yeah, don't mind my singing. I just love the music in this movie. It's so good. And yeah, it's experience award winning music. So it's award winning. It's 
So just so many good songs, such a great cast. It's a great movie. If you've never seen it, literally greatest showman. So if you've never seen it, go check it out. I highly recommend it. It's such a good, good, good movie. So good. Music is amazing. Um, I'm trying to find I Thought I Lost You. Um, if I can find it, I would love to find that. Um, hold on. Let me try to find it. I'm going to try to find it real quick. Um, it's I Thought I Lost You, so start in the I section. I can get to the I section. Found it! Turn the volume up. If you don't know the song, it's from the movie, like I said, from Bolt. And it's really good. I should start downloading The Greatest Showman. I don't have any Greatest Showman music on here. I should, though. Listen to me. Don't hear a single thing I said. I, it's a good song. Underrated. Really underrated. But I love it. I actually do. I wouldn't mind if this is the thumbnail. Just me dancing like this. But then it might end up being blurry. Some of my thumbnails, I find, are do look blurry at times. When I'm just, like, moving around real quick. And it ends up being blurry. I've noticed that in my thumbnails. So, we'll see what happens. And the promises we made. And swore we never break. But I lost you when you ran away. You tried to find me. I thought I'd never see your sweet face again. All right, that's all for that. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'm just recapping real quick. But Human Rhapsody, both great showman, fourth movie. It's kind of a tearjerker. It's a Disney movie. It's a tearjerker. So you probably know what movie it I it is when I say it's a tearjerker. Up, uh, I did cry a bit when I first saw it, and it was a bit sad at first for me. But overall, it's such a sad thing and. It's really cool to watch, too. It's an interesting story. It's following him and... What was his character's name again? Does it say? Carl Fredrickson. Yes, so a retired, retired balloon salesman. And it just says everything about the movie. Um, Doug, the dog. Um, squirrel! I just remember that part. If, you get the, if you've seen the movie, you'll get that reference. Um, so, and... Um, what's the boy's name again? Carl. Yes. And then there's a bird. Kevin, I believe. Yeah, Kevin and... It's such a good movie. It's awesome. It's, um, what's the word? Wholesome. Yeah, someone says up here, a wonderful film. And it says the person's name and where they, um, Roger Ebert from Chicago Sun-Times. That's when that person that rated the movie, I think, from the thing it's from, something like that. So, yes, I agree. It's a wonderful film. And it's, so it's awesome. If you've never seen it, like I said, go check it out. It's so good. It's sad at first, but it's a really cool story. And I love it so much. And, yes, very, very, very good. All right, so... That's a recap and fourth. All right, fifth movie is Night Museum, um, Secret of the Tomb. It's the third movie in the franchise, I believe. Yeah, the first two I don't have on DVD, but I have seen them. But the third one I have on DVD. So, yes, and it was Rob Williams, one of his last movies, I believe. Yeah, uh-huh. And then um, it's Ben Stiller. He's in the movie. Rob Wilson's in this one. It's so good. It's basically the same idea as Night Museum, but this one's obviously different. It's the third one. It's the last one, too. I love these movie franchises so much. Um, it's so good. Um, yeah, there's a lot of people in it. I'm just reading it. It also says Owen Wilson, Ricky Gervais, and a bunch of other people are in this movie. And it's so good. And it's very funny. Rob Williams is very funny. It just makes me sad that it's like one of his last movies. And so, yeah, very tragic. Um, rest in peace to Rob Williams. Um, he deserved to live longer. And it's just sad. Was it Dementia? Was it that he lost his life too? It's so sad. He committed suicide too. It's, that's so sad. I don't know why I did this. I did some sort of hand motion. I probably yeah, it's a bit of a jerk. Um, yeah, no, jerk, twer, twer, twitch. My head switching too. Um, so yeah, so just that movie is so good. If you've never seen it, it says at the back, wonderfully fun, brawlingly funny, and exciting. You see that part right there, right here. That's where it says that. Yeah. All right. So that's all the movies. I'm just checking time, 6.51, so I'm just going to stack them up because I just want to. All right. Um, I just want to check something real quick on my YouTube channel. The time plate I stopped it at on the last movies I like, what time plate? Was it around 17 or 16? I stopped it around... Well, actually, my main goal was to stop it around 16, but it actually stopped around 16.59 going into 17. So I might stop this around probably 17. Yeah, 17. So that's all the movies. 
all five Bohemian Rhapsody, um, both Greatest Showman, Up, and um, Night Museum. So that's all five in the movies. So real quick, I'm going to turn this radio on just to see what's on. Because I haven't done it in a while. Harry Styles. Say you love me. Is he dating Olivia Wilde or not? I don't know. They're saying they are, but I'm still like, I don't know. So. What fruit fire for you? Just let me adore you. If you insist, uh, Harry Styles reference if you get it. Um. <coughs> so, just checking the time over here. I'm always curious at the time. 6.53. Alright, should I show off a couple of TikToks? I've been watching TikToks since before I went to do this. Um. Before I went on to do this, I was watching TikToks. Should I show a couple? I was watching or show some of my favorite TikToks. Yeah, I'm going to show you some of my favorite TikToks. I'll go to my likes. So these are videos that I like. These videos, not all, all these videos. Um, Hold on, I was dancing. <laughs> Whew. Um, these are not my videos. I do not take full credit of them. I just really like these videos. So one I'm going to show off. Um... I'll be stopping this soon. If I could find the one I'm thinking of right now, that'd be great. But if I don't find it in time enough for me to stop it, that's fine. I'll show off in the next video, maybe. But I want to show off one video that I really like. So, um, if I can. Oh, okay. This is funny. Slide on the door to see what your cat does. Are your cat official? Shout out to them. I have their, um, I showed off on my, um, that's just the audio that's coordinated to the video. I'll credit to that person too. It's cute. Pudding is cute. That's the cat's name. Basically, um, I said I have the calendar. I got that for my, what I got for Christmas videos. Uh, the calendar, which is, has the pets on it. So the Oreo cat official has a TikTok, Instagram, Facebook account as well. So if you don't know this account, go check them out. They're really good. I can't remember. Is it? Is it Tina? I said, yeah, Tina. Go check them out. They're really good. All credits go to their videos. This is not my video. Just like I said, a video that I, of theirs that I just happen to like a lot. So, pudding is very cute. The other cats are, what did I say? Oreo. I'm just trying to remember the other cat. Oreo and Ankh. So, go check them out. They're really funny and they're good. Cats are hilarious. Like I said, funny. So, go check them out. Let me show off one more, maybe. Speaking of shout outs, I am Christopher... I think that's the same? Yeah. Go check him out. He's really funny. He does a lot of different things on his TikTok. He's awesome. He does bops and flops to certain songs that he agrees, or he thinks, sorry, are bops or flops in his opinion. So, songs from different years and all that, and movies and TV shows. Go, go check him out. And Broadway's. Yeah, go check him out. He's really good. And, yeah, he just is. All right, that's the video. I'll see you guys next week. Bye.